All right, this is our grade 10 trig review. This is how to use um, SOHCAHTOA to be able to answer questions regarding sides or angles in a right angle triangle. This is the example we did in class. Right angle triangle, 36 degrees, and this is 26 meters long. Our goal is to find side A. First step is to label the sides of your triangle. So we want to always start with the hypotenuse, and the hypotenuse is the side that is across from the right angle. The next side to label is the opposite side, and we know this by looking at where our focus angle is. Our focus angle is the angle that's given to us in the triangle, in this case 36 degrees. So the side that is opposite that, following it across, is actually side A, so this is our opposite and the last side is the adjacent. So to find side, find, excuse me, side A, we are, uh, change color here, um, going to start with looking at what side we need to find and what side maybe we know. So what are the two sides that are relevant to this triangle? And that's the opposite and the adjacent. So O and A. So we look at Sokoto and we try to figure out which one of these has an O and an A in it. And that's this one here. So that means it's tangent. We're going to use our tangent ratio. So it's the tan of some angle equals the opposite side over the adjacent side. And what I'm going to do now is substitute the information from this triangle into the question. So we have the tan of 36 degrees equals the opposite side, which is A, over the adjacent side, which is 26. And now I'm going to solve for A. Um, I'm going to multiply both sides by 26. So that will cancel out. The 26 on this side, which leaves me with 26 times the tan of 36 equals A. And I have to remember that tan 36 is its own kind of entity by itself. This reduces to a particular decimal that your calculator is going to let you know. So in your calculator, you type in 26 times tan of 36, and the answer should be 18. 0.89, so approximately 18.9 meters, and that's it.